Welcome guys, it is the Axeman here, and we are back on Arc Survival Evolved with some more hybrids, yeah boy, and we're in way more of a better mood than we were last episode. Things are going to plan, and we've got a really exciting episode today. So, pretty much what we're going to do, as you could probably tell by the title, we're going to make that final rogue creature. So, finally, 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 it started to respawn. I've been doing... I want to say like hundreds of dino wipes it takes a long time for that dude to uh actually respawn but we are on to the last one uh i've killed another four or five um i think we had to kill six or seven altogether to get where we're at so i need one more kill on this dude and we can make him we just need to do all the dna and stuff which is is all fine but the last one it's in the snow i've seen it we're gonna go hunt it we're gonna kill it we're gonna get the dna and we're gonna make this dude finally uh, i can't wait so the reason i've been able to get all of that dude's dna is uh i've hopped back on here and i've started raising our army and i've done it a different way so the way i was doing it before is i was throwing them out uh letting like 10 or so raise up go out do me shit you know go at afk go and get some food whatnot and then come back and switch them out this time, I invested in some S plus nannies, and I've just thrown all of them out. We've got little spots all around the base where we've got babies growing up. But these ones, I think, have literally just finished growing. Okay, Kronk just scared me then. Uh, these should have just finished growing, actually. Uh, yeah, perfect. So these are, I think there's 100 or so in there. I'm going to leave them there for a hot sec, and I'll uh, cry upon them later. But there's a hundred of them dudes. I've got just under a hundred gigas up top there growing. Down here I should have another hundred of these dudes. Uh, how close are you to growing? Uh, 67. So the uh, S plus nanny gives them like a 1% one in, 1 imprint each time they grow. And then we have the remaining gigas down here which have not long been thrown out. I think there's about... There might be a hundred, there might be 60, 70 down here. But yeah, they're just kind of grown now. So yeah, I've got the army all raised up. We're using the good old S plus stuff because I completely forgot the S plus nanny was there. So uh, yeah, they're all doing their business right now. So we don't have to worry about them. But yeah, next episode, I think... Actually, no, next episode, we're going to do one more or the last couple hybrids. And then after that, we're going to take that army out. Uh, I'm going to have to level them up a little bit somehow. Don't know how I'm going to level up. 300 creatures but it'll be the it'll be the boss fight which is insane and i can't wait so yeah we're gonna get this dude first we're gonna check him out we're gonna see how good he is and uh yeah that'll be the last rogue uh we've got all the operation creatures we're flying through it boys we are flying through it so before we do jump into it any further if you do enjoy the episode make sure you do whack a like on the video you subscribe you ring the bell you never get notifications follow it all the social medias i appreciate it greatly rainbow appreciates it furby god rest their soul also appreciates it uh yeah right let's go say hi to sushi real quick sushi this is one of the last times i'm gonna say hi to you We've got like a couple more times that you'll be uh, you'll be famous on YouTube for thousands, ten thousands of people to see you. It's gonna be a sad day when we see you go, Sushi. You've been you've been my rock. You might you are my uh, emotional support animal, is what you are. Oh man! All right, let's go then. So we need to head into the snow. Uh, you know what? Actually, I am gonna just grab us fur armor now. Who do we want to take out? So I'm torn between taking our other rogue creature have a bit of rogue on rogue action or we can take our um operation giga who's kind of insane and i kind of love it i'm gonna give him some more melee um what do we want to take out what do we want to take out i'll tell you what we're gonna flip a coin here all right i've got a, a 2p a two pence uh heads we shall take out giga tails we shall take out rogue here we go and it's tails it is tails which is you sir so you are coming with me uh the only issue we're gonna have you know it doesn't matter the only issue you have is gonna be half health but i'm sure that's gonna be fine probably all right let's make sure we're all armored up all furred up so my dude is knocking about up this point uh okay that's <laughs> that's a rock we just thrown headfirst into uh, okay, uh, I saw him. Uh, where are we? It's hard to tell where the fog is. He's in a forest. You see that side? I think he's on this side. 
pretty much what I've been doing is just dino wipes, quick fly around, see if I can find them. It's every, like, 20 dino wipes, one of these spawns. I uh, should be around here. That might be it. I saw a big blast. There he is. There's my boy. All right, let's just pop down here. We're not going to be eaten by a giga, are we? Are we all good? Good stuff. All right, Asia. Yeah, you do go to about half health. That's a little worrying, but uh, I'm sure we'll be fine. I'm sure we'll be fine. All right, let's go in there. Let's get involved. Oh, we're doing a thousand. Oh, this dude's really dead already. I'll do some of that. I'll kill the mammoth. I'll do some of this attack. I want to do another breath attack. Yeah, my roll's better than you, boy. And boom. And there we go, boys. The last heart we need. Didn't get a rogue token. I've actually not been getting them, really. Which kind of sucks. But it is what it is. So that is the last heart we need. We can now create our very own one. I can't remember what DNA we needed. Uh, I've got so much chitin. I've got so much kind of krongs. Uh, I guess I'll take some pelt. We'll have to go and have a look. We should have most stuff, but I'm not not really uh, overly sure. But yeah. Easy as pie. Although I've never made a pie, so I don't know how hard or easy that actually is. All right, <laughs> let's get back to the base. Let's have a look what DNA we need, what we're going to be short on, and uh, if we need to head out and get some more shit. All right, so first things first, we need to turn this into the DNA type of deal, or the, the purified one, sorry. Then that goes into this machine. That's going to turn that into the DNA we need. Perfect. And that should be enough. If my calculations are correct, this is the final 12 we need. If I pop that in there, rogue. Perfect. So, yes, yeah, just a little bit over. Awesome stuff. Right. Uh, we need common dino. Excellent dino. Could I pull this? Um, all right. So, we need excellent dino, excellent mammal, and exotic DNA. Okay. That's not too bad then. It wasn't like an overly lot of it. So, excellent dino. Okay, I'm going to be sure on organic polymer. But that's okay because we have 39,000 uh, over there. So, I could actually make another 100. Let's go. What else do we need? Mammal. Make sense to have that. And then exotic. Uh, we can make a hundred of that. All right. I'm going to craft all this. Uh, we needed some sort of egg as well. I forgot what egg we needed. A large synthetic egg. Good stuff. Egg is this bad boy. Large synthetic egg. I don't have the polymer because it's all in there. Crap. All right. I'll tell you what. I'm actually just going to go out. I'm going to get some polymer. Just going to go and hunt and get some polymer. And kind of just any other general, you know, keratin, meat, uh, pell, any other kind of stuff we're going to need. Because we've got to wait for all of that to craft up anyway. So let's just go see if we can fight a handful of penguins real quick. And then we'll see what uh, what extras we need after that. And this is normally the little penguin spot. I am not seeing penguins. Can anyone see any movement? Is there any penguin movement here? Hang on. Uh, Azrael, I'm stuck on you. Let me down. I'm going to crack me uh, ankles here. It's fine. Uh, I'll be stuck under you as well. This is going great so far. Um, is there any penguins about? Oh, there's one over there. Just the one. All right, Kronk. We're going to go and eat one penguin, apparently. Apparently, we must have just hunted penguins to uh, extinction. Is there any more anywhere? Frick off, Piranha. I don't care for you. Right, that gives us a little bit of a speed boost. Only when you fight one, you see all the others just, like, running for their life. Huh interesting stuff. Okay, well, I think, actually, you know what? I think we only needed 60 for that egg, wasn't it? It was 60 or 80. Huh, that's really bizarre. The penguins are normally, like, thriving around here. Okay, well, I guess then there's hope 60 is enough. Uh, I'll wait for that DNA to be made back up at base, and maybe I'll have to come back here. Maybe some penguins will respawn in if I leave the area. Hmm, that's very weird, though. All right, that's all of the DNA made up. Let's see what we are actually uh, sure on. So if we click on to my guy here, let's go to pull. So we need 100 excellent mammal 
and 300 common dino and then one large synthetic egg which uh, um actually i we got 60 or whatever it was um organic polymer we did need eight here i'm hoping we get 20 from just my squashlings and stuff actually just producing it i ain't gonna worry about that just yet so dna we needed excellent mammal so i need some more common mammal of course i do and for common mammal oh no we're all good let's make uh screw it let's make 100 and then we need common dino which needs to go get some fish meat all right sweet that's uh really not that bad okay fish meat uh i guess we're gonna take our uh sea serpent out right i also see a duck in front of me there's the organic polymer we needed hell yeah boys nice okay i forgot to bring my scuba gear i know i'm right next to the base but i can't bother to turn around and get it uh, maybe I should have, actually. Where's all the little fish? Come on, I need... Oh, shark. Do you give me fish meat? I always forget. Got biotoxin. Uh, raw fish meat. Perfect. That's what we need, boys. Uh, if we can find another... Actually, you know what? There's loads of fish here. This might be all of the stuff we need right now. Uh, okay. Let's just get some oxygens. There's nearly a thousand uh, meats uh, that we need. I'm going to take that right now before you eat it. We've got a hundred and some of that shit. Uh, is that all I need right now? You know what? I'm just going to park you right here. Because then I can literally turn around and just eat some more fish if I need to. Alright, good stuff, sir. Alright, common mammal, 79. That should be perfect. I accidentally just put some organic polymer in there. I'm just going to leave it there for a sec. But if I come over to here, go pull. No, apparently I need to take it out here. Okay, so I actually had so much organic polymer... Like, a crazy amount of organic polymer. Uh, apparently, I just couldn't pull it out there because I, I guess it was crafting stuff. All right, what the heck, whatever. All right, so there's that egg being made up. There's the last bit of DNA being made up. Um, let's just wait for that to finish. Then we'll get this uh, dude finally created. All right, let's have a look. What do I need now? Is that everything? That is everything. Uh, research, crafting. There we go, boys. We're making the orifery... I don't even know how you say that. Oripheroteropod, dude. I'm going to call it creepy, snowy, rock drake guy. That's what it's going to be. All right, let's wait for him to be created. Then we'll uh, do our usual, give it the description a read and uh, play around with him. And... Oh, God, I hope this guy's sick. This is taking way longer than it should have. Okay, let's freaking go, boys. Let's get out into our little uh, open area. So, here we go. This is the, uh, yeah, the, the terror. Let's just call him Mr. Terror. The rogue terror guy. So, description. Live their lives in pain. Okay, well, that's a horrible start. Now I don't want to make it. Why do I want to bring this dude to life if it lives its life in pain? Uh, so, lives their life in pain. They prey on some creatures solely for their blood and have been observed vomiting that old blood mixed acid as a form of defense. This abomination also has a hatred for its prey and, simpl and simply destroys environments purely out of spite. Termination is a priority. Where they come from does not matter to you. No further questions. Control T. <laughs> uh, Q, sorry. Control Q. What does that mean? Is that like a special move I should be using? Aw, I feel really sorry for this guy. He should have never been created and left let loose in the wild. Aw, bless him. All right. So we've actually never really got a full on close up of this guy because we've. Oh, my titties. You are scary, bro. Yeah, we've never really got a proper look at it because we was just kind of like fighting him. Look at his feet. Bro, you got massive feet. You know what they say about big feet, right? Big shoes. God, you've got a crazy face. Is the man... Oh, my God. The way he, like, turns his head so fast. Is uh Oh, he's got little, like, horns on his nose. Okay, I'm just, like, trying to take everything in. So, um... <laughs> it's mouth. It's got a... Is it a donkey? Like, the donkey, uh the dude in the water. It's got, like, his mouth. But then inside of that, there is teeth. There is a lot of teeth. A lot of scary teeth. We've got horns and all kinds of like spiky stuff on his head, which looks sick. He's got crazy eyes, which I love. And then he doesn't have any arms. They're, they're, there's nothing there. He's got a very hairy chest, though. Very alpha male type. Uh, he's got like the little pegos, um, which you call them hairs on the back, some little stego plates and like a Kentro-y stego tail. 
Oh, right. This dude's crazy looking. Like, definitely the stuff for, out of nightmares. Do we need a saddle to ride you? We do. I think you do have your own unique saddle. Let me go and have a quick look. Uh, is that it? That's it. Perfect. I don't have enough electronics. No! I finally ran out of electronics. How much do I need? 72. Titties. All right. Let me go make some uh, electronics. Hang on. Hang on. All right, there we go. We've got a got a good 200. I can't remember how much we needed, but I think that covers it all. Uh, right, boom. Uh, e R Y. There we go. Perfect. God, it's been forever since I ran out of electronics. That that felt weird. I felt I felt weak then. Right, boom. Saddle. You know what? I didn't actually 100% check that was the right dude, but it looks like it is. I just saw the name pop up. All right. I am very interested to see what type of moves you do, sir. All right. So let's have a look then. So we have uh, 14,000 health, which is a pretty uh, good start. Can I fit through here? Nope. Of course I can't. You're just slightly uh, too big. We have some nice speed. What was that, Pego? I see you somewhere. Well, it looks like we're going to fight you. So left click. We're missing him. 295. All right. Right click. Oh, hello, kangaroo. Oh, hello, Allos. Hello. So we do bleed with the right click. C. Ooh. Can I do a C again, please? Ooh, 348. X. Oh. Oh. I'm, I'm bloody. I've got stuff around me, and I don't know what that means. All right, we're going to have to try that on some other creatures. Uh, Q. Okay, and then what does it say? Control. Oh, 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 there's the blood. Oh, control is the blood. Okay. What did Q do then? Huh. Can I do control again? Oh, that thing's gross. I love it. So am I gaining health right now? Oh, you died. Okay, okay, oh crap, right, right, right. Let, let me just get back to base. Let me try and see what the roar was. This dude's crazy. We've got loads of powers and attacks. That's amazing. Um, all right, I'm not going to level you up just yet. Let's just go quickly test out what this actually does. So was it C was the roar? Uh, no, X was the roar. Okay, so what did what does that do to you? Uh, plus 10% damage bonus, 15% of health will be restored. Oh, I like that. I like the sound of that. So you get health and attack? Hmm. What was the range on that? Is that something that I should be using for the boss fight? For the hybrid boss fight? Let's see where, I'm, where I reach from here. Um... Okay, that, that one's there's just run out. All right. So I want to know the range because if we fight the hybrid boss, I'm always worried that it's going to do a big radius like attack like the um, the second boss we did where it like instantly killed us. Okay, well, that's a maybe then. That is interesting. All right, so what was Q? I'm confused what Q attack actually is. It's like I'm eating. Do I have to eat a dead body? Do you think that's it? Right, let me kill that. Oh. Hey, no, that's mine. Oh, yeah, yeah, I ate a dead body. Eh? 25 damage increase. Health is increasing, bro. This dude's kind of sick. So if I press Q on a dead body, I do more attack. So let's see if I uh, kill some of the stuff here. There we go, I think. Oh, no. Uh, oh, yeah. Uh, plus 15 speed. Food is draining fast. Huh. Okay. There's just all sorts of abilities going on. Right. Let me level up. Um, no. Yeah, I'll pay you. I don't know what you're chasing. Leave it alone. Um, all right. So health. Can we get that to 20? Perfect. And we can do the rest into melee. So, yeah, it says plus 15 speed. Food is draining was 15% speed. Food is draining. Wait, so is my food draining speed it, or have I got speed and my food is draining? <laughs> okay, I think I had speed because I do feel a little faster. Is that a uh, Alpha Raptor? It sure is. Let's go and kick his butt, but before I do, 
if I can, I should have probably uh, pet Rainbow. Rainbow, give me some extra XP, please. There you go. Good stuff. Let's go and fight that so we can get as many levels as possible. Hello, sir. All right. Uh, so, what am I? Oh, yeah. Control. So that. That means I'm just going to constantly heal. Okay, I'm not healing very fast. It's actually, I feel like that's gone. All right. This dude's a little, a little strong. Boom. Do I not heal from you? Do I have to breathe on numerous things? Um, Alright, I saw my health go up a little bit then. It's hard to tell when I'm fine and Alpha Raptor keeps like trying to kick me ass here. I don't... Oh, okay. I was going to say I can't keep using my uh, control attack. I've got uh, no stamina. <laughs> I didn't realise I had no stamina left. Alright, this dude's nearly dead. I didn't get the kill. Uh, the bleed damage killed it. We didn't get the kill on it. God damn it. Uh, that's annoying. That That is one thing that really does annoy me in the game. When you make a creature bleed and that's what kills it. Even though it was my creature that inflicted the bleed, you don't get any of the experience for it. It, it just doesn't count. Uh, that's annoying. All right, you're going to fight me. All right. I wanted to test me health. So 105. All right, so it looks like it goes up about 20. 20 HP for a few seconds. Nothing crazy. Right, let's go and fight this uh, Spiner, because Spiners give good XP. So yeah, I'm a, a 107 Furter. Let's try this real quick. 107 Ninetale, 107 8. Yeah, okay. So it goes up. It's not bad. It's not bad at all. And then if I was to eat a dead body. So do that. And what is it? Q. Okay, so now we're one... Okay, so that's... You know what? We're healing quicker than the Daedon's healers. If you look in the top right, I know it might be hard for some people to see if you're on a small screen, but that's just healing from eating summit. And then enemy is going to stop. And now we just go up one HP per second. More or less. Huh. Interesting. I kind of like this guy. <laughs> I think this dude's pretty sick. I love this. Um, I want to do the that horrible breath attack. Regurgitate all the blood I've been eating. Suck it out of you. Not Q back. I could literally eat all the creatures down here. So if I do Q attack here, just eat everything. So does that stack? 26, 25, 24, 38. It does stack. Oh, so that's going to go up 5th there. Eat this one. That should go up to like 6th there. 62. Ah, so you kill a whole bunch of stuff. And yeah, health increasing. I'll do my uh, boosted attack damage. 300. 400. Put some levels into there. Headbutt you. 428, 407. All right. I, you know what? I have to say, this is probably one of the more balanced hybrids we've had. Like, so far, I don't have anything to complain about. Like, got good stam. Got good speed. Health isn't overpowered. We're not doing crazy damage. We're doing, like, damage you'd expect from this guy. Its abilities are sick. Like, I'm loving the abilities. Uh, the crazy breath attack. We've got... How many attacks? One, two, three, four, five, six attacks as well. Damn. Look how we turn as well. I like his little tail turning with us. And uh, obviously, yeah, it looks uh, insane. Okay, uh, that was the wrong one. I just pressed the wrong button. I did a raw on myself. Nom. And boom. And nom. And nom. And eat. I missed the eat in a bit. Okay. So, if I'm comparing this rogue creature to the other one... Hmm... Who do I like best? The other one has that, like, sick-ass fire breath attack or lightning breath, whatever it is. But this dude regurgitates blood of his victims onto other ones. Like, eat him. Get health bonus. Get speed bonuses. Attack bonuses. We have a raw to buff other people. I think this might be better. I think this might be the better rogue creature. He's way harder to get just because they seem to be very, very rare in the wild. But that might just be because I'm on a modded map. And obviously spawns are a little different. And to be fair, Hope isn't the greatest map for spawns. A lot of people have complained that some of them have been really bad. But I've not had an issue. But yeah, they did seem to be very, very hard to find. Oh, God. Oh, God. Hello. Uh, why, why was you eating me like that? 
I wouldn't try it, dumb off done. You die. Okay, I want to I wanna do my raw attack. So if I do my breath attack here, does that not reach? I'm off done. I can't hit the Dimorphodon! There we go. Stop hitting me! Wrong attack again. There we go. Got him. Jesus. Well, that was fun. <laughs> right, let's get you back here then. So, could I breed you? I'm going to guess I could. All right. Uh, imprinted one of these would be amazing. Um, obviously, you got your injections as well. Let me just uh, test you against the other rogue creature. I know we did put a health, uh, in, um, what they call it, injection onto you. So what level are you? You're half the level. So if I was looking at you, uh, what is that? 44,000. So you'd probably only have 20,000 because the injection kind of doubles it or whatever. So I guess they kind of have the same health. Uh, melee, we got that up to nearly 400. This dude's is only on 200. Did we... Oh, no, we gave you all of the uh, injections, didn't we? Hmm. Okay. Uh, I don't actually know. I feel like... I feel like the new one's better. I feel like I prefer the new one. They both look insane. They both are really cool. But if I was going to pick one who I'd rather work towards first, it'd probably be this guy. God damn it. He is crazy. Look how big his head is. I don't know why, but your head looks absolutely mahoosive right now. Okay, that's cool. All right, well, there we go. So there is our new rogue creature. Absolutely insane. Kind of worth the wait, to be fair. Definitely worth the wait. Uh, we're, we're not going to be able to get another one of them made up before the end of the series. It, it, it will take me another 80 episodes to find that stuff. Uh, so let's just have a quick check on our little armies then. So, yeah, like I said, these ones have all grown up. Actually, to be fair, all of them should have grown up by now. But they're all ready. So there's a 100 there. They're not healing very well. I should probably uh, go whack a pig on them or something. I do believe all the gigas up top have finished because I heard a lot of screaming when I was waiting for my DNA to be uh, crafted up. I guess they did a roll when they grew up. Uh, you guys uh, are all grown up, so all 100% imprinted. All the tails moving around. That is strangely hypnotizing. Huh. I don't know. That that made me feel a little uncomfortable, and I don't know why. <laughs> uh, let's go to the gigas. So, yeah, there should be like maybe 70 down here and another 70 up top. Uh, they are all finished as well. Perfect. Hell yeah, boys. So... All I need to do now, uh, I think we need to rebreed the Barry Reapers. I think we need to get another army of them set up and ready. I need to raise up the Spino Verazinos. And that might be it. That might be it. And then we've just got to hope that that moth dude is uh, fixed because we've only got a handful of episodes left. So yeah, next episode, I think we shall create the last two hybrids. We've got the Liprorodon, Leaf Sicphius, and the Brontododic. We'll create them two. Then after that, we'll just do a one episode of breeding. And then after that, it'll be the last boss. It'll be the last hybrid. And we can finally save this world from all these hybrids that got unleashed into the wild. I am excited. So if you did enjoy today's episode, make sure you do whack a like on the video. Make sure you're subscribing. You ring the bell. Never do notifications. Let me know if you're excited for the finale. And thank you very much for hanging out. I'll catch you in a bit. See you later.